Hi folks, welcome to Cinemax TV. Today we'll be talking about... <laughs> Hi folks, welcome to Cinemax TV. Today we'll be talking about... Balanced and Unbalanced Connections. Here are some examples of common interconnects you may find. Mic cables, balanced. Guitar cables, unbalanced. RCA interconnects, unbalanced. Let's look at these connections in a modern recording setup. Most new interfaces will come with a balanced input and balanced outputs. On monitors, like this one, you have an unbalanced in and two balanced inputs. This one has got one unbalanced and one balanced. The easiest way to differentiate between a balanced and an unbalanced connection is to look at how many points there are on the connector. This is an unbalanced guitar cable. It has got a hot and a ground, which is similar to an unbalanced RCA which also has a hot and a ground, two connections. Now that would be different from a balanced XLR connector. This one has got three points. It's got ground, hot and cold, which is also the same as a balanced quarter inch connector which has got hot, cold and ground. Now, this is not to be confused with a headphone jack. Now, this headphone jack carries two signals, left, right, and ground. So this is not a balanced connection. What makes a balanced connection superior to an unbalanced connection? Let me explain. In a balanced connection, take for example, you have a signal. Now when it is sent to the connector, you have your hot pin which carries the original signal and your cold pin which is face shifted by 180 degrees. So this signal then becomes something like this. Now as the signals travel through the cable, they may come across interference or noise which will affect both signals equally. For example, Now when both signals reach the device, the cold signal is then phase reversed back. So it becomes like this, but with the noise going this way. Well, this one is like this and the noise goes this way. The two signals are then summed together and what you get is the full signal with the noise cancelled off. Therefore, balanced connections can carry signals over a much longer distance and with better quality. We hope that video was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below and don't forget to subscribe.